POC Network here with another unboxing, this time coming from the company Lucid Sound. And what we have today is their LS41 wireless gaming headset. And this is one of their newer models, and we're going to take a look at it today. We're going to pop this open, we're going to see what's inside the box, what does it look like, what does it come with. And then you're going to go to the website at pocnetwork.net, where we're going to have a full review about this later on. But let's go ahead and take a look at this. So what we have here, it's a gaming, a wireless, like I said, gaming headset, and it works for multiple different solutions. So we're talking just about all modern consoles, Xbox, One X, PlayStation 4, the Nintendo Switch, and PC. It works on the PC, you know, laptops, uh, computers, uh, tablets, smartphones, given that all of that is wireless. So if you're using this on a tablet or smartphone, you'll want to go wired. And for just about everything else, it's wireless, except for the Xbox, which requires a 3.5 millimeter connection between the headphones and your controller to bring chat into the mix, where the game audio itself is wireless. But as you can see here, the headphones are pre-packaged into a little bag here. It almost looked like a case even with this little flap popping out, but it is a soft bag. You have some instructional material there and that's it. So you have your headphones in the bag. You got some documentation here. We have a user guide, which just runs you through the general operation of it. It's gonna tell you how it works with every console, as I just explained. Uh, you have an intention, little notice here. Uh, do not return this product to the store. Please contact us if you have any questions and all that stuff. And by us, I mean them. Lucid Sound, not us. So the bag has a very unique kind of um, a design to it. Kind of feels nice, too. A little smooth kind of feel to the hands. Has a little uh, loop here, so if you want to hang it on a hook or something, uh, you can definitely do that. And the lip here is uh, really the most unique part of this bag. It just has a nice reinforced lip. Uh, it's closed via just a small piece of Velcro right there. And then the headphones are inside with all the accessories. All of the accessories are within a smaller pouch inside of here. Uh, it's, it's felt lined on the inside, which is really cool, you know, which is gonna protect it from scratching. But you got this leather piece of Velcro here in a small little pouch, and you have all the accessories, which I seem to be throwing all over the floor here. You got some more cables and adapters, and then that's it. So that, that's pretty nice that you're able to keep everything together in one bag. When it comes to accessories, you have a USB, it's a micro USB to USB cable. This is specifically for charging the headphones with only. You have a 3.5 millimeter to 3.5 millimeter uh, cable here, which is going to be for, as I explained, smartphones and tablets. And of course you can use it on anything. You can use this on your computer and your laptop or anything. Uh, most likely, hopefully, if the battery dies, you might be able to still use them as a wired connection. And also, as mentioned, this will be what you used on the Xbox. So this will work with, uh, this will work with an Xbox One, but you have to uh, put this in line between the controller and the headphones in order to bring chat, game chat, into the mix of, of what you're listening to and not just wireless audio from the game. But as for the audio from the game, that is wireless coming from the receiver. You also have the microphone that connects into the headset here. It uh, just plugs right into the bottom and you're ready to go. We have an optical connection here, which is uh, for digital 5.1 sound. And we have a small little hatch, little door here, which is actually used for covering up the mic hole. So you just kind of plug that in there just like that, fits in there nicely. And that just keeps dust and stuff out of the mic hole. So if you, if you don't actually ever plan on using this or you plan on go, traveling or something like that and using these just for music enjoyment, then you can leave your mic at home and just cover that up with that. And you know, it's nice and protected. So the last thing here in the accessories we have is uh, the actual USB adapter. And this is what you plug into your computer, your laptop, your PlayStation 4, your Xbox, Nintendo Switch, it's USB powered and you have, if the console does not, it looks like support, if it doesn't support the audio through the USB port itself, then you would want to use this optical cable, which will run from the console end and plugs into this uh, 3.5 millimeter optical port right there. And then that brings your optical sound to this and then it sends it off to the headphones. So it's a really simple configuration and a really nice and soft bag to keep everything into, uh, which is really nice, so it keeps everything together. And it's just really comfortable, and it's really thick, so it should store really nicely without hurting anything. So for the headphones themselves, um, they have some uh, kind of an average amount of weight to them. They're not too bad, they're not too heavy, they're not, too, uh, they're not surprisingly light or anything, 
but I would definitely put them put that in the middle. Uh, both sides are covered by little stickers here. Uh, so this one says, uh, it's just kind of forewarns you, you know, ahead of time that for, if for the Xbox One, connect the chat cable to the controller to use the mic uh, or else the mic isn't going to work on the headphones. If you peel that away, you'll notice it just gives way to a button here, uh, which is, uh, has the Lucid Sound logo there. And then on this side, you have the hold the PS button and select sound devices set output for to headphones for chat audio. So. For the PS4, this will work for both game audio and chat. And of course, peel that down, and it's the same thing. You reveal this big button underneath, which has the Lucid Sound logo on it. What's really neat about these uh, is that each button is actually used to control the mute function of a different aspect of the audio you're listening to. So the left side, when you press it, is used to mute the game audio. So if you're, you know, if you just want to mute out the game audio, everything that's going on in the game, you press that and it mutes out the game audio. On the right side, you press that, it mutes out your chat audio. You know, so that, or in other words, your microphone. So if you want to stop talking to people, but you still want to hear the game, you hit the right side. If you want to hit the, if you want to stop hearing the game, hit the left side. But in addition to that, the plastic that's going around this, and we'll just kind of, we'll just remove this sticker altogether here. Um, the logo, uh, everything as part of that is just one big button, but the plastic going around it, this is actually a scroll wheel. And what that does is this controls the volume level. So if you want to take volume down for the game, you would rotate that wheel and uh, or bring volume up or of course if you want to take volume down or up for your chat audio you'd be able to do that on the right side so you have easy access to both volume controls and, and muting people in and out or at least the game or the the actual chat audio so there is no fumbling around for buttons for the most part when it comes to that you know so when you're in the game and you just you, you don't want to hear anybody or hear, you know you want to mute your microphone tap it you're good to go you know, you're not fiddling around for any buttons. Your hand is right back to that remote as fast as possible. As for other functionality, everything is on the left muff of the headphones. And uh, you have your little slot there that we had covered that has the mic input right there. That is for the mic. You have your 3.5 millimeter connection for analog, which is the little regular auxiliary cable. And you have a USB micro input right there. That's for charging the headphones. And then you have your power button, which turns them on. On the right side, even though I said all of your stuff's on the left side, uh, the right side does have one button, and that is EQ. These headphones offer multiple different EQ modes, you know, so surround, stereo, and so forth. So you can play around with those to see which ones you like best for whatever game you're playing or device you have it connected to or whatever you're listening for, you know, is it, is it, are you watching a movie, are you playing a game, are you listening to music? So it's really simple. Uh, you're only gonna be playing with these in your initial setup. So when you're actually in game, you got the easy buttons, you got your easy mutes and volume wheels on both sides, and uh, that's it. So both headphones are adjustable for length and uh, just a little bit of swivel. Um, this is uh, quite common to make sure you got a nice comfortable fit on your head. The actual cushions are really nice. The inside cushions right there are threaded, which is kind of cool. It just gives a nice kind of a, a design appeal to them. And then the actual muffs come off, which is not too bad. I mean, that, that, that came off really easily. I didn't have to really give it much effort. So if you want to clean these, if you want to, you know, pop it off and blow some air on the inside to shoot any kind of buildup of, we won't discuss what might build up, but whatever may build up inside of there, you can shoot that away. Just kind of wipe everything down, clean the cushions, or even replace the cushions completely. Maybe you want to, maybe you're starting to rip through the cushions because you've been using it for the last couple of years, or you want to switch colors or something. If let's say they actually offer customizable colors or designs or anything, um, it just pops right back in. And like I said, simple. As for what it feels like, it actually feels pretty good. You know, you're not going to get a lot of noise cancellation. I can, uh, I can still, I can still hear the ambient noise and the environment around me. You know, so it isn't about that. It's just about delivering audio, and that's it. And uh, since it's coming from Lucid Sound, and this is one of their better models, uh, we can only assume it delivers pretty decent audio. So beyond that, feature-wise, these are headphone X headphones. So they're not just stereo surround or, uh, or your average pair of headphones. These are virtual 7.1 surround headphones and they use DTS 
Headphone X technology to deliver that. And what Headphone X is, is just another method of delivering virtual surround sound. So that's it. That is the LS41 wireless gaming headset from Lucid Sound. Uh, for more information, definitely check out plcnetwork.net where we're going to have a full review on this later on once we've had the time to test this out and see what we like about it. And of course, if you liked what you've seen here, don't forget to subscribe below. There's that button as well as a comment section. And as always, we thank you for watching and we'll catch you next time. If you want to stay on top of all the latest and greatest and or at least the gadgets we cover, remember to subscribe right here. Subscription button. Click it. You're going to want to. There's lots of videos, interviews, previews, all sorts of stuff. Button. Click it.